I think it's about time I add another five star to the profile. What do you guys think? Gwenpool getting a little bit lonely up there? Yeah, man, let's get another five star on the profile. Let's do a rank up. It's been a long time since I've done a rank up video. I stopped doing these things a long time ago because who wants to see another four star again ranked up? But this is a pretty big deal. This is the second five star champion that will be going to rank for someone that can uh, stand proudly up there with Gwenpool. Who could that possibly be? Hulkbuster, Iron Patriot, maybe this triple duped Winter Soldier. No, of course not. It's it's going to be Hulk, guys. It's going to be Hulk. It's going to be the freshly duped Hulk. And there's not much else to say other than let's do it, man. Let's rank this guy up. And just like that, I've got my second rank 4 five-star champion. Pretty happy to have Hulk on the team here. Definitely boosts my profile a little bit, makes it look a little bit better. Just got to get those uh, those other two four-star champions out of there, and then it'll be looking really good. Um, but yeah, I, I definitely definitely needed this man. It's been a long time coming to get another rank four or five-star champion, and I gotta say I, I wish his prestige was higher. I'd be a lot happier with Hulk overall. Like I'm still happy about it, but I'd be a lot happier overall if if his prestige was just a bit higher. Um, I am going to, uh, you know, go ahead and increase his, his signature ability level a little bit here. I want to see what it is at 20 first. Uh, all right, so 1,028 attack based on health lost. Um, real quick, i got to pop into uh, some crystals here to open up and just boost down his signature ability. Uh, I'm also going to raise Gwenpool's a tiny bit, hopefully. Just picked up these, uh, these five from the master mode. Come on, science and skill. Okay, one of each. I mean, that's that's all I could really ask for. That's fine. Um, there's only five of them, right? That's pretty good that I that I got both of them at least. So yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna up Hulk's ability here. Let me go ahead and feed this one to uh, Gwenpool really quick. All right, there we go. Bump her a tiny bit in prestige, and then yeah, let's go ahead and, and bump up Hulk. So all right, again, we were at 1,028. Let's go ahead and pop some items into this guy. I'm going to pop all 10 science ones, of course. I don't expect to get any any science champion soon. Although, you know, I do have that uh, that, that science awakening gem still. Uh, Alright, what does that take him to? That's 1178. And let's give him a few of these basic ones. I'm trying to save the majority of these basics for uh, Stark Spidey. But I do want to uh, increase my prestige as much as possible. So I'm going to take him to level 40. And now it's 1326. Okay, that's pretty good. Um, it, you know, it, it, it scales up decently for his, for his prestige and his build and everything like that. Um, you know, the one, the one big downside about Hulk, though, is that his prestige is really, really low compared to other five-star champions. Um, you know, as, as, as useful as he is, as cool as he is and everything, um, he, at, at Signature 40, if you compare all of the five-star champions at Signature 40, I think he's like the, the 17th worst or something like that like he's really he's really down there there's like 80 or something like that 85 stars maybe a little bit more than that uh, and yeah he's like the 17th worst um, you know just to give some idea about why I did not want to use that awakening gem on Star Lord uh, to bump the prestige right of course Star Lord's also a, a super useful champion everybody's always talking about uh, you know asking me to use the awakening gem on him Star Lord is actually even lower than Hulk Star Lord is like the seventh worst or something like that at signature 40 he's really really down there um, so either way, it's it's not the biggest prestige boost, but it's something, man. I need to contribute to my alliance, and uh, yeah, this is this is the way to do it for sure. I'm gonna be testing Hulk in a lot of different areas, but for the sake of keeping this video short, I just want to Hulk smash this magic one time, real quick. Let's get this little three-star Hulk out of here. Let's put the five-star Hulk in. And really, what I'm curious about is how hard can his level two hit once I go into uh, Hulk Smash mode. So I gotta, I gotta kind of take a few shots here a little bit, get my health a little bit lower. Go ahead, Magic, do your thing. Oh, it's gonna be good. Oh wait, I don't want to go to my SP3. Well, let's see what the SP3 does. 
Oh, she's dead probably, right? Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, well that was pretty good. But we don't know any damage numbers from that. Damn it. Let's try this one more time. So I have to get down to 25% health because that's when I go into Hulk Smash mode. But I have to make sure I don't go above two bars of power when I get there. Um, and I also have to make sure I don't just straight up kill magic because look, she takes a lot of damage. When she's in, when she, when she's in limbo, she's going to heal it back up so I can attack her a bit. Let me dump this power real quick. Alright, there we go. Go ahead, magic, do your thing. Take me back up. It's good if I attack into her while she's in limbo because I'm not going to kill her. And I can gain power that way as well. Alright, there it is. We're in Hulk smash mode. Boom! 42,000 crits! There we go. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Alright, that's that's pretty good. That's pretty good. Hulk. Yeah, Hulk, Hulk smashes, man. That's some good damage right there. <laughs> Alright, I'm, I'm pretty happy with this guy, I think. For now, guys, that is going to do it for this video. Thank you very much for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Take care.